Hey guys, welcome to my new video. I will show you how to install BSL shaders in Minecraft 1.20. Let's get right into that. As you can see, I have both of the files that we need, which is Optify 1.20 and BSL shaders on the desktop already. So what you need to do now is to go to the video description. There's two download links. Click on them and download both files. Then take them and drop them on the desktop place. That's what I did. And uh, after that, we have these two files on the desktop, and we need to get them on in, in the, the, into the roaming folder. So here is the search bar. So type in percent fdata percent please and hit enter. It will open up the roaming folder, and in here go to the dot Minecraft and scroll down until you get to shade packs. In here, just take the BSL shaders and drop it in there. Go back, scroll a little bit more down and go to versions and double click on Optifine. A window will, will appear with the installation. So simply hit install and wait and then you see Optifine is successfully installed. Just make sure that you have 1.20 Optifine in here in case you don't have that. Is a big issue because uh, you didn't install it properly. So 120 Optifine, make sure you have it there and then just open up the Minecraft launcher and we have to choose 120 Optifine and uh, then just hit play. Yeah, so in case you don't have 120 Optifine in here, you have to repeat the step that I have showed you. So 120 Optifine, hit play and we need to wait a couple of seconds then uh, the mica will load up for us and i'll actually show you how to apply the shaders so it'll work for you as you can see i'm already in the minecraft you can check that uh, i have one of any version so i'm not lying to you go to the single player and your word sherlock is my word i have made it myself so i'm choosing that you can choose whatever word you want. Uh, once we are here, hit escape on the keyboard, go to the options, video settings and shaders. And in here you should see BSL shader, okay? So in case you don't see it, you actually need to check the shaders folder if it's in here. If it's not in here, just take and drop the shader in here. Then hit done. And as you can see, it's working properly. I don't have any issues, uh, neither lags or anything. So thank you so much guys for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.